Hey everyone, I am back with another video, a little bit different this time. Uh, I know it's been a little few days since my last video. Um, if you didn't see my community post, my boyfriend's brother ended up having his baby three weeks early on Memorial Day. So that's where we were then, uh, super adorable, healthy, cute, um, all around wonderful. So um, I hadn't found anything on the weekend. I didn't go dumpster diving at all on Monday or Tuesday. Um, so I don't have anything to film for you. However, I do have a drastic, drastic room transformation. Uh, so in just a second, I'm going to put the before video and then I'm going to film the after video. But I just wanted to tell you guys that this was very eye-opening for me. Um, I had a lot of crap, literally, like stuff that I do not need shoved in my room, like under my bed, in the closet, in the drawers, um, most of which I have been saving from dumpster diving for the future. Like if we ever move, get a bigger house, you know, if I ever know someone who does this or blah, blah, blah. Um, and it, it was pretty good stuff, but it was making my life and my room a mess. So I'm going to show you, I'm having a garage sale on Monday. This giant pile right here came mostly from my bedroom. Um, a lot of it is from the dumpster, a lot of it is not, but this will all be being sold on Monday um, because it was absolutely ridiculous. So it kind of opened my eyes. I'm definitely not going to stop dumpster diving. I'm just going to be a little bit more picky with what I end up bringing into my home and what I end up keeping in my home. So for sure I will still be posting regular videos and all that stuff, but I'm going to control myself. So let me um, put the before video in here right now. I did forget to film the before video, so I had already start, started pulling everything out of the drawers and on the floor and everything. But um, I'll put that right here. That was the before, and this is the after of my bedroom transformation. So I'd never really, like, decorated my bedroom. I'd showed you guys briefly before, but I'd never had it decorated, so I never really wanted to show it off. So here we go. Uh, we do have, you know, a fairly small little house, so we do what we can. Uh, starting right here with the bed. If you remember, this whole bed set came from the dumpster, as well as this pillow. Let me show you this way. So I have the like overlay, the tufted comforter, throw pillow, these two shams, there's more, this sham, and then these also came from the dumpster, this pillow came from the dumpster, as well as the case. So there's the bed, and then right next to the bed I have this little side table that I found a while ago. I didn't end up fixing the other one. First of all, it doesn't even fit if I wanted it to on the other side, and it was just too busted. So I took one of the little feet from the other one, and put it on this one so I don't have to use a tuna can anymore <laughs> to hold it up. And then just a placemat. There will be more on here eventually, but this is my boyfriend's side of the bed. Eventually when uh, my dad has a chance to come over right here on this wall above the bed, this blessed sign that I fixed a little while ago will be hanging. So that is going to go up here. And potentially these two beautiful frames on the sides. Um, so that's a possibility. And then over in this corner, I traded out my huge, ugly, dark Ikea dressers for this one that I had in the living room. Oh, this is one of my favorite finds ever. I love this. Uh, I love this chevron wood detailing. And then I took this little wreath of sorts that I found a while ago and put one of the plants I found recently in it. And it's on a little saucer so it doesn't get wet. So always nice having a live plant in the room. I think I might actually put another one because I have so many. <laughs> and then this candlestick is not from the dumpster, but the bird, the salt lamp, and this beautiful frame as well are. So I really like this little corner of the room right there. And then going this way, all of the curtains are also from the dumpster. I have the white sheer ones and then these gray ones on the outside with this really nice um, stitched circle design. So there's that. Uh, right here, just briefly, have my hamper, which I've had for many, many years since I lived with my parents. 
And this rug that I found just a few days ago, it, you know, it's not too contrasting from the carpet, but it's still kind of cute. And it has a little wavy design. And it, you know, it's good for the floor, whatever. This bench, uh, my dad actually fixed up for me. And he has been storing it at their house until I told him I was ready. And now I'm ready because here it is in the bedroom. I found this a little while ago. They didn't tear it up or anything. So I really love that a little end of the bed bench with the nautical blanket that I found on it. Um, yeah, so that's about it. And then once this gets situated, it'll be even nicer. That's just our little bedroom. Um, cute little closet over here. Nothing crazy. Let me see if I can get most of it in one one go around. Yeah, that's about it. So much more peaceful, much airier. It kind of feels like a spa <laughs> rather than our dark, dirty, dingy bedroom that we had before. So definitely eye-opening um, doing that whole process. It took so long, but I have cleared literally everything out of this room. Now we just have what we need and then the decorations. So... I'm thankful I did it. It took a while, but now I'm going to have the garage sale of the century <laughs> on Monday. So I will definitely be back with some more videos, just more uh, thought out of what I bring into the house. So once again, thank you guys for watching. And thank you um, for all the comments and likes and everything on the community post I made. And as well as my last video, I got so many views on it and so many subscribers came from it. So welcome, and I will be back with another dumpster diving video soon. <laughs> dumpster diving video soon. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.